Hey guys, this is Gus and Carlos from Hardware Unplugged and today we're going to be unboxing the MM720 by Cooler Master. But before we get started, please make sure to hit that like button to show support and if you want to see more content, don't forget to subscribe. With that being said, let's begin. All right, so we have the Cooler Master MM720 right here. Uh, we got it because it's apparently it's meant for claw shape and the shape looks very interesting. I don't, I don't think I've ever seen the mouse look it's like really that. weird, dude. Honestly. Yeah. They have, <laughs> apparently there's one of the mouse that is modeled after this one that yeah, came yeah, out yeah. a few years back. From, from the same company, right? From Cooler Master, I think. I'm yeah, not was, sure. Was, I'm, yeah. I'm pretty sure it was from Cooler Master. I think I saw it. It's like a, it was one of those like heavy mice. One of those, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Old school yeah, mice. Yeah. yeah. Well, it looks old school, yeah. yeah. Definitely isn't, it doesn't have holes, but yeah. So we have the M7 Land right here. I guess we'll make a uh, quick comparison with this one. Now the shape, I actually really liked it a lot. Yeah. The only issue we had, and it was a major, major issue, issue, was the side flex. I mean, oh you, I mean, the, you could put minimal effort. Yeah. Like, like remember you were doing your jitter clicking? Dude, it, it's so, and it's so ridiculous because I feel like Cooler Magic can easily fix that side flex problem. Yeah. They didn't do it with the, with the M710. They didn't do it with the M711. And so I don't know, man, like M720 has side click issues. That's gonna really off yeah it's it this mouse was, was not a bad mouse it was actually a really good mouse but man that they didn't even bother trying to fix those issues so yeah um, that was a huge disappointment because i like the performance of yeah. this mouse pad uh, this mouse i mean uh and it actually could have been one of my favorites yeah same. but that cyflex issue just, just ruined the experience ruined me it. a lot like i couldn't use it at all every match we'll play yeah. on apex whenever i get somebody will scare me or whatever or yeah. I'll, I'll get an intense get moment intense gunfights, dude yeah. I'll, I'll activate that cyflex a lot and i didn't like that so <laughs> yeah yeah so we're definitely gonna be checking out the build card in this one but yeah, so far the shape, uh, shape wise, they're nothing alike, and they're gonna be testing out the cable too. So yeah, let's go ahead and unbox the M720. I'm actually kind of excited for this one. I've never felt a shape like this, yeah. you know. I've never seen a shape like this, you know. I've never felt a shape like this. So, okay, so in the box you get some grips, grips, those grips. Yeah, yeah, those are grips, dude. Huh? Wow. Okay. Yeah, check them out. Them yeah, out. check yeah. them out. And you get yo extra yeah feet. you do get grips let me see yeah those are grips for it hmm they yeah. don't feel that grip if I'm being honest but no, they, they kind of do they feel like rubberish what are you talking about they kind they 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 kind of do they're not they as grip oh okay as, okay, as, okay. As, as, okay. As, as, like the hobby they're ones? not they're not yeah no they're they're not it's because they're not textured you know what I mean yeah. like, they don't have you know, like a pattern shape yeah. But they they feel very rubbery. I don't know if you, like if you can feel that like a little like, bit. Yeah. It? It's, it's a little too smooth. That's what I'm saying. It, it, it feels a little smooth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, I, I can see how they're probably not gonna be that grippy. But yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I I still I still think they're they look cool. I will tell you that. I don't yeah, think I, I've seen grips look no, in the model yeah, like that. Yeah, they like smooth I mean? out, right? Kind of. Yeah, you know, but it also looks like a like a aluminum finish. You know? Yeah, kind of. Kind of. Yeah, 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 yeah. Almost. I see it with the lines and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like cool. a brush aluminum. An alcohol pad too for, for you to clean your mouse face and so And extra feet, one around the sensor included. That's cool. Yeah. So they give you extra feet and grips for how much? How 50 much? bucks. 50, 50 bucks. bucks. Here you go. Already been in some of the other companies out there that, yeah. that offer <laughs> less for 50, so. And this is the shape. Now, the shape. Let me take the KY here. Cable was supposed to, well, we all know that Cooler Master did it first with their great cables. Oh, it's a glossy. Oh, yeah, I it's a glossy, know, I yeah. Didn't, I didn't realize it's anything. a glossy, yeah. I only had glossy white for at the moment. If not, I had to wait like an extra like four days to get the, uh, the, yeah. the black ones and like yeah. that and get the glossy one. The cable is... Just as good. I don't know if it's because this one's old already, but it's, it's, it's flexible. It's a good cable. It's a good cable. Yeah, you know it's what I mean? Cable. Yeah, it's a good cable. Yeah. It's just, I, it's the same, dude. Yeah. It's the same. Yeah, it's the same. Yeah. It's it's in, in terms of it being loose and stuff. It's a good cable, yeah. Yeah. It's a good cable. It's a good cable, so no complaints on the cable. The shape wise, holy crap, this feels like a rock. Like, I like, feel like I'm holding a stone <laughs> in my hand, dude. No lie, it's wide, it's big. But you know what? It feels different. It feels kind of comfortable. I feel like. Are you palming it? Yeah, yeah I'm right. palming it, but I feel like the more I. I feel like it'll kind of blend in after a yeah. while. I'm very used to the shape, but it feels very comfortable, I'm being honest. It doesn't feel. It doesn't hurt my hand at the touch you know what yeah. i mean but we still didn't try it the feet let me see do you have any classic mm -hmm. ones mm, they don't look like it nope mm -mm. Mm -hmm. nope the feet they uh 
Yeah, yeah lightweight claw grip mouse gaming mouse. This is right there. Claw grip. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I ain't climbing. I'm actually palming this. <laughs> um, side buttons. Let me see. Now can I activate them? No, I cannot one? activate. But that thing almost broke. That's not. I don't like that. I don't like the build quality, man. It like it snapped into place, dude. Yeah, I heard that. That was loud. Yeah. What the heck? Okay, let me see the scroll wheel. I gotta even press it hard, dude. Yeah. Silent. DP. I mean, uh, the uh, scroll wheel button. Let me see the uh, clicks. Ooh. Ooh. Yo, these are really. Yo. Okay. Very little pre travel, but. And also a little bit of post travel. Not, not as much as the mouse. No. I feel like mouse no, no, no. had a lot more yeah. post travel. Yeah, this is pretty good, actually. Not only that, there are also different switches. These are, uh, these are, uh, it doesn't say, but it is this optical is switches. They're optical switches rated for 70 million clicks. Yeah, so that means they're gonna be really fast. These are so. rated, and the one on the M711, probably M710, probably. I'll, I'll, I'll see, but these are put for 20 million clicks. So oh, so these are, are better? High rated, above, like, I guess, you know? No, yeah, they're gonna last you longer because of the because the optical switches what they use there's a laser in between them and uh, you, there's like a yeah, it blocks it yeah right? it, it blocks, blocks the laser so it, yeah it so they'll, it'll, it'll last longer because there's less components in the switch and stuff but that's pretty cool let's go ahead and take it for a spin i'm actually kind of excited I well, even yeah try it <laughs> try it that's so awkward that's so awkward what is this dude? The yeah, it's D-pad. Yeah, so they have a D-pad button and button in the bottom, not in the top. I don't, know, I, don't, I don't know how I feel about this, dude. <laughs> I feel like you're holding a rock. At least to me, that's it, the best way I can explain it. Like, I don't like the feet. Like I'm gonna smash somebody in their freaking head. That's what it feels like, dude. I genuinely don't. I I don't know. I don't. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't. I don't like it. But uh, maybe maybe I'll get used to it. I don't, I don't know. Oh, uh, before you before we try it, I'm just gonna actually wait. Let me see. They advertise the weight at B. 49 grams. 49 so. grams. So let's go ahead and uh, measure that. I'm just, I'm just trying to get a feeling. 51. 51.3. 51. 51 grams. So two grams over? Or about one, one, one and a half. Yeah. And a half Not over. much. It's, there, it's closer than freaking HG Gaming, all right? Yeah, HG <laughs> Gaming, they always advertise, oh, you know, our mouse <laughs> is like, you know, 49. And when you use it, it was like 60 or something. <laughs> 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 or uh -oh. like 50 something, you know. <laughs> But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and take it for a spin. Um, yeah, go ahead and take it for a yeah. spin. We'll be right back. Yeah. All right, so we're back from testing, and the shape is definitely an odd one. You know, uh, when I used it right away, yeah, I, I couldn't. I didn't know how to hold it because I don't know. I'm, I'm used to palming, and this mouse is not really meant for that. I can palm it. I can palm it, uh, but it's not the com most comfortable for me. Um, yeah, this shape is one to definitely get used to. So yeah. if you're somebody who's used to ambi shapes, because I'm an ambi mouse, you're more of an ergo mouse, ergo mouse person, yeah. right? I'm an ambi player, and if you're gonna try to get a new mouse and try to open it, unbox it, and plug and play and play with it well, yeah, I don't think this is this gonna be the one. No, yeah, this is not no, it. No, 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 no. Is the shape bad? No, no I don't no, think the no, shape no. is bad though. <laughs> I actually, it. I played with it for about 15 minutes, and after yeah. the 15 minutes, my hands started to get a little adjusted to it. Um, but I still wouldn't play as well as something like a uh, Hottie S or something like that, you know? Yeah. But can I, if I get used to it, I'm pretty sure I'm able to play with it really well. Um, what do you think about the mouse? Uh, well, you palm it, right? So yeah. definitely, um, so I relaxed clock with the mouse and uh, it, the mouse was uncomfortably comfortable, if that makes <laughs> any sense. It's just uncomfortably comfortable. Um, and I say that because whenever I hold it, it just feels weird. It's a very wide mouse. Like yeah, it's, it is wide. it's a very short, wide, stubby mouse. Yeah. And I like at first like my brain was like, how do I even like grip this mouse? Yeah. But after playing with it, you know, um, I was actually quite comfortable. Um, but at but at the same time the thing that really throws me off is this it has this little groove here for your ring finger. Yeah. And that that like my brain is kinda like what the why hell, is you here? know yeah like why is this here like and then like my pinky kind of rests pretty well it's it's a very weirdly uniquely designed mouse it's it's not that it's bad because i don't hate it but it, it it's just so freaking weird dude. <laughs> like uh, i'm i'm definitely gonna i'm definitely gonna have to take some time uh for me to adjust my brain to it you know yeah. to adjust the shape and whatnot yeah. but uh 
this is definitely not no beginner mouse for the, you know no. for to start with no it, it it's a very awkward shape it's not bad it's no it's not say bad that it's awkward it yeah. doesn't mean that it's bad it's just mm -hmm. more of a i could tell you have to have like a learning curve using this yes uh, yes using this mouse. definitely definitely um I'm probably gonna have a little bit more easier time than you. Yeah, just because you you're know, less just because yeah, you. like you know, I do use uh, mice that are not like I'm ambidextrous, you know. And they're and, ergo. Yeah, and and this one fits okay, you know, and it fits okay, you know, for like my claw style. Well, for my relaxed claw style, so it's actually not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. Um, it's just it's just a very awkward, uniquely awkward shaped mouse. Yeah. It's, a, it's again, in my opinion, it's uncomfortably comfortable. That's the yeah. thing I could really like describe it as. Yeah, and the build quality for sure on the MS720s oh. are way better than the MS711s, MS710s. Way uh, better. Um, that weird issue right now where I press aside, uh, doesn't didn't come up again, didn't mess any internal stuff or anything like that. I was able to play with the mouse really fine. You snap something back yeah. in place, so <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> right? Um, but uh, yeah, if anything, do I do we think it's a bad mouse? No, I don't think it's a no, bad it's mouse. not. Especially for fifty dollars, dude. Yeah, it comes with grips and extra pair of feet and those optical dude. switches. They are responsive. Yeah, Remember they he are. Said we were yes. overshooting, undershooting a little bit. Yes. undershooting. Yeah, it's probably because of the yeah. switches. They're really yeah. fast. I I I thought they're pretty like you know like snappy too, honestly. Yeah, so they they're pretty good switches, they're quick. honestly. They're quick. Um, the mouse just looks hella funny, dude. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> it just looks hella yeah. funny. So I was also able. I was able, I was also able to notice how light it is, dude. It is yeah, really, it's really light. Really light. It's, it's really light. light. I was able to freaking and move around easy oh easy uh, mouse pad. the feet I, I don't i don't think they're really like sharp edges right not not like 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 not that i could tell i, I feel like the feet are right is actually yeah, pretty decent actually pretty again good. cooler master i never really had problem with the, the feet. m710 feet yeah. either um i, I want to say those are thinner than these because these look a slightly thicker like so like check out the bottom ones here and then yeah. look at that one right they're like thinner these and, yeah yeah, these and, are yeah. in thinner. my opinion it looks like it. those are thinner but they're way wider um and you kind of feel like the smoothness on, on them you know just because of the whole like whiteness of it yeah so i i actually kind of prefer those more you know just because that's a bigger uh, surface for the feet yeah um yeah, yeah it's kind of it's kind of surprising it's not yeah, bad fifty dollars no uh should you get it if it you know if you're gonna get a first time uh lightweight mouse no i don't i don't no. think you should try it if it's your first time getting a lightweight yeah, good no, mouse you got yeah i recommend staying away from it yeah audience. you know get something you know get something else get something that you know that's more safer for example like a razor viper mini that that's, that's safer, always a safe sure. you know that's a safe shape um but if you know what you want and if you want a claw grip mouse and if you like an ergo mouse yeah uh i don't i don't think that's a bad i don't yeah, think that's a bad mouse for you to try honestly yeah it's, it's definitely one to try for it's sure it's definitely on the medium to small hand uh sizes if you're yeah. a, a large person i i don't know how you're gonna like it i, yeah, I, I don't I, know really, like, i really don't i can't see a large person claw grip right? i'm pretty sure you can uh, yeah, yeah, design yeah. for claw print, it is right? it is but it is, i mean but, me as a well, us as we're like medium, we're, like medium. medium. we're in the yeah. medium side of things i mean i could I, this feels like comfortable i don't know how large-handed people are gonna feel yeah. about that you know yeah, what i mean yeah. but uh well, right it's it's a very short stubby yeah. white mouse yeah, I, it's, yeah. It's, yeah. <laughs> i'm telling you it's I, a very I, unique I don't know. despite me not being able to play with it that well i still like it a lot yeah i yeah. still like it a lot it actually surprised me yeah. honestly <laughs> yeah me too me too it's actually a pretty cool mouse good job yeah. uh cooler match yeah here. <laughs> yeah, so this is Gus and Carlos from Hardware Unplugged, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.